One of two African ground hornbills, the birds that escaped from the Honolulu Zoo yesterday, is back inside of its enclosure tonight. There were a total of three birds in the enclosure when this large tree was uprooted by the winds. It lifted the sidewalk. It busted down the enclosure. We were there yesterday afternoon as zoo employees tried to catch this bird, one of the two that was spotted flying around Kapilani Park. This is Martha. Unfortunately, they were unsuccessful. But this morning, officials returned to the Diamond Head area where they heard Martha. And then they saw her, and thanks to some food, as well as one of her mates, the one left behind back at the zoo, they were able to get Martha to return home. They do have an excellent homing um, instinct, so she wanted to fly back to the zoo. Uh, we then chased her across to uh, the Ironwoods um, in front of the um, aquarium there. Um, then she flew to the banyan tree. We brought out her mate. Um, uh, her mate vocalized to her. Um, they did the call, brought her back. She flew over the zoo, back into the zoo grounds, and then we were able to lure her back into it. She walked right back in, and we closed the door behind her. So easy in the end, right? Now, a third bird, a 15-year-old male, is still missing but likely hungry, and they're hopeful that he, too, will return on his own. Zoo officials say a lot of folks are likely going to hear the distinctive deep calling sound at sunrise or again at sunset or sunrise tomorrow or sunset tonight. Again, they ask if you see or hear the bird, don't approach it, don't try to feed it, but instead call 911.